Welcome to Missouri Earth Movers. This is part four of hydraulic systems, and today I'll be talking about telescoping cylinders, also known as multi stage cylinders. Now, here at the top, I've got a basic uh, telescoping cylinder drawn out here. And uh, basically, telescoping cylinders are used when a regular, normal, single stage cylinder just physically will not fit in the machine. And a telescoping cylinder, as I stated earlier, is basically a multi-stage cylinder with two, three, four, five, and even up to six uh, units that are added onto it. Uh, and basically, in a telescoping cylinder, the piston rod becomes is used as the piston rod and the piston barrel, and then a second, third, fourth, or even fifth and sixth uh, piston is added. So as you can see here, uh, this is your barrel, and then you got your piston rod here, and the piston rod also becomes the barrel of the next uh, and so on in the series depending on how many you have. Uh, these are also more expensive than single stage normal cylinders obviously there's more components uh, stuff like this and uh, one other thing to note about telescoping cylinders is almost all of them are created to be a single acting cylinder or a push cylinder basically and you can see this primarily in uh, garbage trucks and dump trucks that actually have a, a bed on them or even flatbed trucks they have a bed on them and you'll see a cylinder that lifts the bed really high these are telescoping cylinders because when the cylinder closes uh, a normal cylinder physically I mean it would be you know 20 feet long 30 feet long so they basically use a telescoping cylinder here so that that 20 or 30 feet goes down to you know maybe 8 to 10 feet and it's more manageable and basically how this works is you're going to have a fitting here. Now this isn't totally exact, but this is just a basic here. You're going to have a fitting here, and then you're going to have a um, a valve and everything else. And like I said, uh, if you guys want to check out more on hydraulic systems like the basics, uh, feel free to check out my other videos. I have uh, part one, which is hydraulic system basics, and part two is hydraulic uh, fluid basics. So moving on from that, um, you can see here, you're going to have pressure going in that's going to force you know the first cylinder out once that cylinder hits its peak the next cylinder will go out and so on and whenever you are lowering it there's no it basically uses gravity and the weight of the cylinder and the weight of the bed and everything coming down on it and it basically just has all the fluid go back to the reservoir and it basically has the pump i guess go into like a neutral type state and it lets it you know roll go all back to there and uh, there actually is um, two-way or dual-acting um, telescoping cylinders. You're not going to see these very often. Um, I didn't really see too much information when I first looked here, so uh, if anybody is interested in that, I will try to find more information on where you'll see those. But most of the time you're going to see the single-acting push cylinders here in telescoping multi-stage uh, hydraulic cylinders. So. Uh, if you have any questions, please feel free to leave them in the comments or personal message me. I'll help you guys out best I can. Uh, more videos to come on hydraulic systems as well as many other things. And you guys all have a great day. Thanks for watching.